am here at the Fort Wayne Artists Guild and they have so much to offer, including featuring local artists. And we have an opportunity to take a sneak peek at an artist who is also a member of the Guild, Sam Hoffman, as he is painting something very creative. Hi, Sam. Hello. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. Good, okay, so Sam's artwork is very interesting because it's very, natural it is landscape based and it really pops and so if we want to come come behind and take a look at what he's painting sam share with me what's happening here uh this is a photograph i took uh many years ago in uh, mexico just mm -hmm. north of cancun uh, the seascape that, mm -hmm. uh, i've been trying to paint for several years and maybe I'll get it right this time, I don't know. Yes, very awesome. And so let's talk a bit about your painting style and what made you start painting in the first place? Well, I was a professional photographer for a long time and then they went to digital and mm -hmm. I lost a lot of the creativity. Mm -hmm. So I channeled that into some painting, tried the watercolors at first and that's far too difficult. So I switched over to oils and I've been painting in oils for about 15 years now. Okay, yes. And so as we look around um, the art museum, we see your paintings, which are so beautiful. I told you, I said, wow, I feel like I am in the scene with you, like the waterfalls, the stone. So how did you get um, so talented to be able to create that 3D aspect? A lot of that is from the photographic training with uh, composition using light and color mm -hmm. and that sort of thing. And uh, the detail, I'm known for my detail work usually. Mm -hmm. So uh, a lot of that translates into the oil paintings. Yeah. And so what made you really focus on the landscape side of things um, as opposed to other type of artwork that's out there? Um, landscape, is, I've worked mainly for photographs. So with landscapes, I can take the pictures and bring them back into the studio. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah, so have you done like portrait work or any uh, dabbled I've, in other things? I've done a few portraits. I'm really not that good at it. <laughs> That's somebody okay. else's specialty. Yes. Okay. And can you tell me and kind of share about your experience being a part of the Guild? It's been fantastic. It's mm -hmm. uh, the interaction. There's so much talent, local area talent in uh, the arts in Northeast Indiana. Mm -hmm. And that interaction with other professionals and learning from them and growing with them. And the opportunity to exhibit my artwork and sell my artwork alongside them has just, just been amazing. Yes, and I know that the Guild offers workshops and different educational tools. Do you teach in those um, type of environments? I do not teach. Okay. I would be a lousy teacher. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not a very good student. I wouldn't be a very good teacher. Yeah, no. well, maybe you can teach me a little something. So maybe share a technique or brush stroke or something. Kind of walk me through what you got going on. Um, this is a plein air style. So we start with a like an orange and red underpayment underneath it. Mm -hmm. And that uh, with the plein air style, it kind of shines through. Mm -hmm. And let's, uh, there's a lot of motion and a lot of glow from that underpainting. Mm -hmm. And uh, lets, the, lets the painting come alive. That's really nice. Yeah. So out of all the pieces here that you have, do you have a favorite piece that yeah, you have painted? Yeah, I think so. Yeah? Wanna go over there? Yeah, let's take a look. So which piece is your favorite? Okay, we'll go with this one, The Weight of Water okay. um, from Cascades Park, just on the north side of Bloomington. Uh, this was uh, from a photograph I took a few years ago. Mm -hmm. It was featured in the Hoosier Salon annual exhibit oh, last nice. year down yes. at the Indiana State Museum. Uh-huh, very nice. I yeah. mean, I just really love how it pops. I mean, literally, I feel like the water is splashing right, right. out of the frame. That is so awesome. And so people can come here and check out your artwork and also purchase it? Absolutely. Yeah. Okay. Well, thank you so well, much, Sam. You. We thank appreciate you. it. Yes. You all can check out all of the artwork and the featured artist here at the Fort Wayne Artist Guild. We'll have their website listed below. And we'll be right back.